Hi, this is a price action analyst. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Serum, SRM. There's not a lot of uh, time frame on this. This is daily bars. So there's not a lot of time frame to work with, but uh, this was a subscriber request. So I'm just gonna do an analysis on it regardless. These are hourly bars. Um, price when it started has probed down here and that's been rejected, it's been bought up. You've had a consolidation and then a breakout and um, two legs up, really. Um, and importantly, you sort of had price, you know, up to resistance, down to support. This area was uh, washed a couple of times and then a, a retrace of that and a push up. You had a wash of this resistance level and a wash of the lows and a big push up. So. Um, you know, it's definitely uptrending and my premise is definitely up. This retrace came in deep. You can see it made wicks here. And then on the retest of the wicks, even though they were washed, it left another wick, which is a indicative that price was going to push up, which it did. So you've had another strong move up. And now because this is a second uh, test of this high, one, two, um, and you've had strength going into both of them, it's it's high probability that this is gonna push up from here. So um, if it doesn't push up, the levels that I would be looking at are here and um, worst case scenario, there's air here and you've got support. So, you know, I would expect a wash of the support level, maybe like, you know, if price makes another wick there, uh, that would be indicative of the start of the move. but you know, this, this level here is a sign that, you know, prices down here were rejected or bought up. And so if price does come back into this zone, expect buying pressure here. But I'm thinking that given this move up and the context of all of this previous price action, you know, strong move up, uh, retest, push out of there. Uh, I don't, I don't see price coming down here again, and this is lower probability than, you know, something like that. Um, price has just come, you know, shallow, and then it's already trying to push out of here. So if you had to get involved in this coin now, the way that I would play that is go down to say 10 minute bars, and then If price breaks or looks like it's going to break this level, then you could get long and see what happens here. And I don't, this is late. Like, I don't like taking, you know, trades inside of wicks like that. But again, given the context that I've just explained in this consolidation and then a push up, you know, especially if it comes out, retraces and pushes up here, um, and you want to get into this coin, you can try there if that happens and then see see what the run looks like because, you know, the projection should be something like that. So that projected move would, you know, that would take us, you know, that's a, if it does that, that's a breakout. So, you know, that's indicative that price might push past there. So, you know, if you wanted to get, if you were desperate to get into that coin, that's how I'd play it. I would, I would buy a break of that level if price pushes up here. If not, if price, you know, if this is a failed breakout and price continues to cycle down, watch here and watch here for buying support. So this this air here was triple O two seven six, and this area here is triple O two nine four, triple O two nine nine. Um, and again, like wait for price to come in here and wait to see what it does, and then you know look for an entry trigger. Um, but overall, this looks very strong. That's you know again that's the second test of that level. 
it washed, it failed, but the retrace is very shallow and then it's proceeded along here, which is indicative of strength to me. It's indicative that price wants to push higher. Um, and just, just be aware, you know, price will often do what it's doing. It, it will stair step its way out of here. You know, it's, it doesn't, the majority of the time price is stair stepping, you know, it's the minority of the time that it's doing this sort of stuff. You know, it's doing this most of the time. This is what your eye sees, what it goes to, but this is what's happening most of the time. So, you know, just be aware that if, if it starts doing stuff like this, this is, this is, this is still moving up. This is up. So, you know, and this is even better if you get a wash of the low and then a push up that when it washes that low and then pushes up, you can be even more certain that this is going to push outside up to the next. And then, you know, when it starts to get to these levels and it's showing strength, then you can start guessing based on the projection and the size of these previous support and resistance lines, you can start, you know, guessing where your next level of resistance is. Um, so hopefully that helps you. Um, the person that requested this, I'm assuming they already have a position. If you have a position, I would hold it at this stage. It looks, looks strong to me. It looks like it wants to continue going on. So uh, hopefully that's helpful. Uh, please shoot me an email if you have any questions off the back of that. Um, for people watching, please like the video. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and uh, check out my services in the description box of the video and see if you're interested in anything like that. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.